And all main and nearly all residential streets in Denver have been plowed, according to the mayor. A second pass is now underway. They're looking pretty decent out there in terms of the roadways. But the Fox 31 weather deck, it can't be plowed. And it really hasn't been shoveled that much either, unless Matt got to work without telling me. Uh, Matt, show us just uh, in terms of the snow that we're seeing out there. I don't know if you've been able to measure, get a sense for how much snow has fallen out there you on know, the Fox Erica, 1 News deck, weather Erica. deck. It's not piling up nearly as much as it could out here, and certainly in a lot of other areas. That's thanks in part to the relatively warm temperatures we've had today above freezing in the mid 30s and also 60s that we've had for the last couple of days. You can see it piling up on the weather deck out here, maybe about four or five inches or so, but that doesn't mean that the snow is not causing impacts for the city of Denver, particularly here in the downtown area. A heads up tomorrow, Denver Public Schools, they will be closed. Kids will be getting an extra snow day. City offices will be closed. Libraries and rec centers, they will be shut down as well. And RTD now telling us expect delays both tonight and tomorrow because of all of this snow and as Dave has been warning us about a lot of this is expected to freeze as we go through the overnight hours and our coverage here on Fox 31 of the biggest snowstorm to hit Denver in the last three years continues with the Fox 31 news at 530 right after this.